It is almost time for kids to go back to school, and that means school buses will soon be back on the road. And that's right, and that's why AAA is reminding drivers to be alert and obey the law in school zones and at bus stops. 41 NBC's Andrew Willis heard from local and state agencies about how to keep kids safe this school year. We all need to understand that what's most important is protecting our children. And that includes when they're trying to get to and from school. And when you're stopping as the law requires you to, you're doing your part to make sure our kids get to school safely each day. School buses are the safest way for children to travel to and from school, according to the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration, or NHTSA. But the most dangerous part of the trip is when they're getting on and off the bus. That's why the Georgia Governor's Office of Highway Safety, along with the Bibb County School District, Department of Public Safety, and the American Automobile Association, are reminding drivers to slow down and pay attention while driving in a school zone or near a bus. We never know what they may do. We know what the ex expectations are, but children will be children and they may dart out in front of your vehicle. According to state law, traffic on a two lane road must stop in both directions if a school bus is stopped with its lights flashing and crossing arm extended. This includes multi lane roadways with a center turning lane. For roads with a median, traffic in the opposite lane is required to slow down. If you are unsure of what to do, stop until the bus has resumed travel. If you see a child crossing the street or standing at a bus stop, slow down and pay attention. When driving through a school zone, always obey the posted speed limit. Just a 10 mile per hour increase in speed uh, is likely to result in more injuries and perhaps even a fatality of a car uh, is uh, met uh, meets with a pedestrian. NHTSA data shows bus drivers reported more than 50,000 drivers in the U.S. illegally passed a stopped bus during a single day in the 2020-2021 school year. Drivers are urged to eliminate distractions, obey the speed limit and traffic laws, wear a seatbelt, and always drive sober for everyone's safety. These reminders really are in place for one specific reason, and that's for our so our children can have a safe and a happy school year. In Macon, Andrew Willis, 41 NBC News. School zones in Bibb County are active from 5 a.m. until 9 a.m. and from 2 p.m. until 6 p.m. Parents of teen drivers are also encouraged to talk to those teens about how to drive safely to and from school.